you want a certain number to be divisible by 72. So note that if you have one divisor such that you break it into two co-prime factors or you want to factorize such that the two factors are co-prime. Co-prime as in they are not divisible by each other or their highest common factor is 1. So I know one pair as such 8 times 9 is 72. So you will figure out that pair first. And now you want to make sure that this number is divisible by both 8 and 9. Okay. So we will look at this number 8. When is a number divisible by 8? A number is always divisible by 8 when it has exactly the last three digits making a number divisible by 8. So you just have to look at the last three digits 7, 8 and y. This part has to be divisible by 8. So what will I do is I'll just see what should be my number y or the digit y. So 8 times 9 is 72 giving me 6 as the remainder. So now my number formed must be 6, 60 something. So think about about 8, 8 times something is 64, which is 8 times 8 is 64. So only when this is 4, only when I have 4 instead of y, I can make sure that this overall number is divisible by 8. So it is confirmed that y has to be 4. Okay, I got the first value y as 4. And now what do you want is if you want a number to be divisible by 9, that is quite easy. You want the sum of digits to be a multiple of 9. So because I'm already saying this y here is 4, what happens is you want to remove all the multiples of 9. Okay, so 6 plus 3 is 9, get rid of it. 5 plus 4 is 9, get rid of it. Now the remaining part is 7 plus 8, 15 and another 15. 15 plus 15 is 30. So what's the next multiple? 30 plus how much gives you a multiple of 9? Definitely 30 plus 6 is 36 which is a multiple of 9. So therefore this digit x has to be 6. Question wants you to find x minus y. So I'll just do x minus y which is the difference here is just 2. Hence the answer is 2.